Hi, welcome to my channel. This is Francis Lava, and this is my first video in the series of video about cleanup and catch up of a bookkeeping job using QuickBook Online. But in this video, I will just show to you how to create QuickBook account and this Excel file of PC Wizard Corner. I will be transferring these balances to QuickBook. And we will start from here, the unadjusted trial balance. Then this column, the adjusting entries or clean up. These are the adjusting entries of correcting entries and the unrecorded transactions happen on or before October 2021. Then here, the, the adjusted trial balance of October 2021. Then this column is the entries of November to December 2021. And this last, last two columns are the final ending balance as of October 2021. Now let's create a QuickBook account. This is the website of Intuit where we, where we will create a QuickBook account. I will be using this uh, advanced and we will do it in a trial version only. Here we will put the your email ad and the password then click uh, sign up. I will copy paste my email here and password. Then, oops, uh, I forgot. That's, uh, let's click here. Then look for Philippines because I'm in the Philippines. There you go. Then a circle number. Before I click the sign up, just follow the questions step by step and I will speed up the video. Ah, uh, I just have to focus on あ、there you go there you go we have completed the process now that we have a newly created quickbook account by default this is the view 
Let's click here and switch it to Accountant View. Uh, I'm more comfortable using this Accountant View. Uh, let's click this again, Accountant Setting, and let's do some setting here. So, okay. Mm -hmm. um, billion subscription. This is the expiry date of trial uh, usage. Mm, sale. Uh, service date. Um, let's just turn this on. Uh, discount. Deposit, mm. then save. Next, show product service column. Show product service column. Um, let's turn this on. Then, um, truck inventory on hand. Yeah, this is very important. Let's just turn this on, uh, continue, then save. Okay. Next, uh, uh, default change supplied. Uh, let's turn this on. Uh -huh. uh, turn this on. Uh, we will cancel this one because we are using a, a trial version. Next, create multiple partial invoice. Uh, let's try turn this on. Uh, we will we will cancel this one also. Cancel. Next, expense. Uh, truck expenses and items because yes let's turn this on make expenses and item available yeah turn this on uh, default bill payment uh, let's make this 30 days before yeah, 30 days save then uh, payments Payments and time, uh, we don't have advance. Mm. Um, close the book. Uh, yeah, we will turn this on later after we have done posting all the adjusting entry. The purpose for this is that the books of the previous months uh, that are already closed cannot be edited or cannot be edited anymore once we will turn this on. So, for now, we will leave this off. Next, charge of account. Category truck classes. Yeah, let's turn this on. Warn me when transaction isn't. Let's, let, yeah. let's check this one. This one. Yeah, let's just leave that. that. Yeah, let's just leave it that way. Then locations, turn this on, and and let's, let's try division. Yes. Then uh, mm, next, uh, currency. Uh, yeah, we'll turn this on. Click here and look for php because we are in the philippines yeah there you go and multiple currency yeah we will leave this at this uh, we will leave this off because once we turn this on there's no way that we can turn this back to a single currency so my advice just leave it so uh save Next, 
uh, number format customer warmy if duplicate check number is used yeah turn this on warmy when i enter a bill number that's already been used for the vendor for that vendor uh, yeah turn this on uh, yeah turn this on uh, warmy if duplicate journal number is used turn this on also then uh, save uh, let's for the next uh, yeah we're done click done so so we're done we're done for today's video and this is now ready to transfer the balance from excel to quickbook uh, by the way guys i forgot to uh, about the logo let's go back uh, account and setting uh, company company name logo and click here and also here then browse that's it that's how you're gonna upload the logo for now i don't have the logo uh, let's cancel this one so we're done for today's video this is the first video in this series of cleanup and catch up if you want to follow me in this series, kindly subscribe to my channel, like and share the video to your friends who wants to learn bookkeeping, especially QuickBook, and hit the bell notification so that you get notified whenever I upload new videos. And uh, for the next video, I will be transferring the balance from Excel to QuickBook. So, thanks for watching and see you on the next video. Bye.